Could children do this? Is it something that you believe would also help form the habit patterns of the mind of children? I say why not? Why not in the sense that, yeah. of course, um, it is a the meditation is also a, a kind of mental effort, right? Yes. And so mental effort uh, is in itself wonderful yes. for children because uh, each type of mental effort will contribute to more richness mm-hmm. of the connections of the white matter. I bet so many parents are so happy now, of course, but they're like, yeah, right. Children learn how to meditate. You teach them, Jackie, or you teach them, Eric. Well, you know, meditation doesn't always have to be sitting down and closing your eyes. There are so many different angles. And with children, you can use sport, strangely enough, to help them learn how to meditate. You can find all kinds of information about that on uh, my website, friendlyeyes.com, with, also with exercises. But you also have to make it fun with children, you know? And the big advantage with kids is, is they don't have the baggage that you get when you become older because, of course, they're fresh in life and, and they don't have that many deep habit patterns yet. So when you become creative and teach them how to pay attention just a little bit to this and then a little bit to that, and you swap it around and without them even realizing it, you've got them having laser focus on different things at different moments. Um, they can learn how to focus in a very, very different way. 